Hey, this is Melanie Funches with your Mental Health Association's Wellness Wednesday. Today we want to talk about the fact that there's two sides to every story. You know, you'll go on we go on social media, it's a major part of our lives, and we'll go on Facebook, here on Facebook or on Instagram, and we'll see people, pictures of people, and we'll see all the stories they tell, and we see these great pictures of people's lives. And what we want people to remember is when we share things on social media, we curate the images that we create, right? We use, like on Instagram, you use the filter. So you may have the filter that has the little puppy ears, or you may use the filter that puts makeup on your face, or, you know, the light that makes that gives you good backlighting and makes it look great from this side or from this side. But those things don't necessarily tell a complete story. The, the images and the lies that we curate for social media do not tell the complete story of our lives. So when we look at the stories of other people's lives, we have to remember that these are not the complete stories of their lives. You know, and so we want people to take that in. And so when you're looking, you're saying, well, their lives are so fabulous. You know, they only great things happen to them. People choose to share good stuff. So that doesn't mean that, you know, every day is sunshine and rainbows for everyone. And I don't, and you don't want to take that in to say, well, what's wrong with me or say anything that's bad with you because you don't see other people sharing. You know, it just means that people are choosing to share their happy stuff. It doesn't mean the other stuff doesn't happen. It just means that sometimes people don't share it. And also when people share, when they do share, like if someone, like a lot of times you'll hear people after someone has maybe attempted suicide or tried to commit suicide, you hear them, well, we didn't think that there was, you know, they seem so happy on their Facebook or their Twitter was so happy, their Instagram, you, they didn't look sad because those are curated images. Again, those are curated images. We put the images out we want people to see. At the same time, if someone chooses to share and come out and say, you know, I just, I, I don't know what I'm going to do or I'm feeling really sad or whatever it is, we need to create, if we're going to be an online community, we need to create spaces for people to feel safe and comfortable and for us to be supportive of people when they say those things. Because many times you'll hear people say, well, um, they got out and they were saying that they were feeling really sad. They just couldn't take it. And we thought, you know, they're just being dramatic. You know, they're just all that drama. Sometimes you know, we've got to take the stance that you never know what someone's going through. So take it seriously and reach out and say, what's going on? Do you need a hug? Can I talk to you? Can we take this offline? You know, can we go get a cup of coffee? Whatever it is, can we go for a walk? Because we need to support one another. Because a lot of times the image we put out is not a full story of who we are. And if we want to promote wellness and make sure we all stay well. We have to both remember that for ourselves, but also remember it and be in a place where we can take care of each other. Remember, the images you see on social media are a curated image. They don't tell the whole story of who a person is or what the life they're living. And also, if someone reaches out and says that they're not, you know, they're not doing well or they're feeling like they can't go on, Take it seriously. Do not chalk it up to them just being dramatic. The life you save may be your own or that of someone you love. Take everything, take these things seriously. This has been Melanie Funches with your Mental Health Association Wellness Wednesday. Please interact with us here on Facebook. Like, Continue to like our page. Interact with us. Let us know if these videos are working for you. And you can go to see us on our website. We have lots of great resources there. And I hope to see you again soon. Bye.